Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you all are doing great. In today's video, we are going to see how to install Xcode in Mac. Plus, I will tell you how to create a C or C++ program in Xcode. So let's begin. First of all, open your app store. You will find it in the bottom. If not, then you can open your spotlight. To open your spotlight, there's an option in the top right here. If you cannot find it here, so press command plus space on your keyboard and type app store and then hit enter. Now we are inside the app store. So type Xcode in the search box. Now here's the Xcode. As I have already downloaded it before, that's why it's showing the update option. But in yours, it will show the install button here. So press on the install and make sure that you have at least 10 GB free on your Mac. After installing Xcode, now it's time to open it. So after opening the Xcode, you will see this pop-up menu appearing on your main screen. If not, then go to the file, new and then project. In our case, we will choose create new project. You can see the clone option below that. So the clone a project is used mainly when you are using GitHub. Tell me in the comment section if you want to know more about it. Let's click on the create new project. To create a C or C++ program, you have to go on the Mac OS tab right here. Then on the command line tool and then press next. So type in the name of the project, let's say my first C program. I am choosing C language here. Type in your organization name or basically type your name if you are working alone. In organization identifier, just type com dot your name. These things are not useful to the beginners, so don't bother about it much. Now choose the language. I am choosing C here. Now after clicking on OK, you will see this type of interface. Your code will be in the main.c file right here. This is the basic code which you will see every time on your screen whenever you create a new project. So you can just remove it or if you want to work within this, you can do within this. I am clearing this. So let's create one basic project. Now type in hashtag include stdio.h int main printf Hello world. Now let's run the program. At the first time it might take some time. Yep, here you go. You can see hello world on the print screen. You can do the same for the C++ language just by choosing the C++ language instead of C there and rest is the same. Only the difference is you should know the language. <laughs> Comment me down if you like this video plus tell me that if you want to know more about C, C++ or Swift plus some extra tips or tricks for Xcode or any other application. So see ya. Peace.